What's up everybody, Thani here. Welcome back to yet another video. Today we're gonna to be talking gag grouper, rod and reel combo for fishing off the Skyway Pier. fishing off the Skyway Pier, you want something a little bit beefy, more drag on the reels, 33, 30 pounds of drag, should be plenty. I've seen guys pull out gag grouper off the Skyway Pier with like 5,000 size reel and those 5,000 size reels drags are typically around 25 pounds, 24, 25 pounds of drag. And I've heard guys pull out gag grouper with a 5,000 size reel. I'm talking about you Chance, if you're watching this video, shout out to you man. <laughs> so when you're fishing off the Skyway Pier, you really want to step up the rod and reel combo man. I typically run 8,000 size reel and 50 to 100 pound class rod, you know, something beefy. So you can just pull them out of the structure really easily because what these gag grouper will do, they'll uh, sit facing up against the current and when they see bait, bait fish swimming by, they just come out of their the, the rocks, snatch it and then try to go back into the rocks. All you really have is a few seconds. And if you don't have a strong enough rod and reel combo to pull them out of the structure, then it's game over, man. You're getting rocked. <laughs> um, let me show you what I typically use out there on the pier. This right here is a Shimano Torres. It's, it's discontinued. It's a 7.6, I'm sorry, it's a 7.8, 50 to 100 pound clasp rod. And I've landed quite a few gag grouper off this rail. If you've seen some of my grouper videos, you'll see that this rod was bending to like a U shape. This 50 to 100 pound clasp rod is bending to a U shape. Now you don't have to go out there and try to get the same exact rod as me. There's also other nice rods in that uh, in that range, that 50 to 100 pound class range. A Mojo Salt Series by St. Croix is a good one. And for the reel, I'm running a 8,000 size Shimano Stratic FJ. This right here is a workhorse for me, man, when it comes to gag grouper fishing or any other bridge uh, fishing, like tarpon fishing off the bridge or, or snook fishing off the bridge. This is what I use, fishing structure. This is what I typically use. And for the braid, I'm running 50 pound braid. I'm doing all right with 50 pound braid for now, so I'm just gonna stick to it. For leader material, I'm running 60 pound leader. Uh, regular mono, it can be 60 pound or 80 pound. I find that 60 pound or 80 pound leader, I find that I get the most bites out of those leaders versus 120 or 100 pound leader. I don't know, I feel like the bait swims naturally with lighter leader, but that might just be me. For the hook, that right there is the Trocar 5 odd. 5 or 6 odd should do you just fine. I typically fish hand sized grunts and pinfish. So 5 or 6 odd is good for me. Now you don't have to go with the Trocar. There's other brands like Gamakatsu. Mustad, Owner makes good ones. Gotta use circle hooks, man, because Gag Grouper is a reef fish. For those of you guys that don't know that, I know it sucks, but you gotta play by the rules. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this little short segment of my grouper rod and reel combo for fishing off the Skyway Pier. If you guys like this video, hit that like button, hit that bell notification, smash that subscribe button if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.